The Technovation Challenge is a program of iridescent, and the main goal of the program is really to encourage and spark an interest in high school girls in technology, computer science specifically, and entrepreneurship. Um, and how that works is the girls, high school girls apply to be a part of the program, and it's a nine-week program where they come in um, with no programming experience required um, to learn about the technical field, but really what gets them excited about it is that in nine weeks they get to design um, and create app prototypes um, and then pitch them at a um, high-profile pitch night um, to venture capitalist judges. It's a great platform because the entry to creating your first program really five minutes later from the time of opening it and following the tutorial you have a working program and the frustration level uh, for the girls is really low. Um, a lot of other programming languages you have to worry about syntax um, and you spend time troubleshooting that syntax you know if you forgot a, a, a punctuation mark that changes everything. So with App Inventor because it's a block blocks-based programming language, you're really clicking pieces together and that snapping together, you know, it either snaps or it doesn't, um, really lets the go girls know if it's going to work. And so that, I think that low frustration level really is a great first programming language for the girls to learn. But you can really do sophisticated co programming concepts with it at the same time. Sixty apps created using um, App Inventor. And you know, some of them have been apps that the girls needed um, in their lives that they've thought about. Um, a number of the girls shared that um, and for one team that they went to small high school and um, they really didn't have a chance to network with other high school students. You know, they're in this small setting. So they created an app called Mingle that would let s high school students um, within certain communities know what was going on at other high school. Um, other high schools around them and they called it Mingle so it was their way to connect with others. One of my uh, favorites is called Tag Deck and it's uh, a flashcard app for students but what's so neat about this flashcard app is you get to create your own flashcards. So it's whatever subject you're studying um, you can then create the flashcards and then share them with other students in your class um, teachers could assign it as a homework assignment, and this, these were all used creating App Inventor and were made in that, that nine-week um, period. One of the things that we did with the girls was pair programming, and so they got a chance to um, work with a partner, um, and they would write code together. So one person is the driver and one person is the navigator, and um, they go through this programming together and a lot of the girls talked about how they really enjoyed working with a, a teammate for programming and learn from their mentors who are part of the program um, that this is what it's like in the real world and they really got a sense of like that computer science isn't working all by yourself in a cube you work in these team environments you problem solve together um, which was really something that they hadn't thought about and didn't think it was that way and um, you know experienced it in the program and also heard it firsthand from the mentors and the TAs who are involved. I, I think that it's just because it's there and so easily accessible. You know they're social. They want to be with their friends and hang out with their friends and when they can't be right with their friend I think it lets them connect with other people. So I think the social aspect of it is huge and that they have information right at their fingertips. You know, it's just right there. You can just look it up. And so I think that combination, the social aspect of it and all the information you need is, is right there.